What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another Mold Man episode. It is uh, nasty here again in Texas. Oh, this weather is killing me. The rivers are blown out, chocolate milk, but we're gonna go give it a try. I got the boat loaded up behind the truck, and uh, we're gonna go to the river, see if we can't set some trot lines out, and maybe catch a few catfish on rod and reel. I don't know what it looks like right now. I haven't been to the river in uh, a week or so. So it could be terrible, but we're headed to the river right now. It's like 60 degrees, uh, middle of May. It's crazy, but uh, I'll see you guys at the river. I'm gonna set some lines out, check them in the morning, so stay tuned. Um, and hopefully we get some cats for dinner. Well, we just got up here to the river. Scott just caught him a keeper catfish and uh, we caught a bunch of bait, but we're just checking out, seeing if there's any fish up here. Um, we're gonna set lines later on and uh, so until then we're just fishing a little bit and uh, see if we can't catch some dinner well guys we got into some fish do what well did he take you into the brush or are you just hung saying some river minnows caught some Catfish, I just caught a hybrid. Scott just caught a tree. Have another little catfish. Nope. Oh yeah. A little catfish. white little hybrid choked it That's going to be a tree shaker right there, boy. Yeah. All right, guys, first pull in. Got our pole in the bank. Address, name, everything. Got a bluegill with a weight. Just barely in the water. We'll see you in the morning, little buddy. Catch me a big one. wrapping up the night no little top water bunch of white bass busting but nothing's hitting so not to call it there's a gobble i think we may come out here and turkey hunt in the morning and check trot lines all right we gotta get back before it gets dark guys just got home and clean these catfish up.
Well, good morning, everybody. Hope you guys can see me. Uh, it's 5:13 here in Texas, and it is 60 degrees. It was actually just 59 and just switched. But if you're coming over here from the last video, hope you enjoyed that video. It is. Uh, it's time. It's time to go check trot lines, and uh, might possibly try to do a little turkey hunt. That's why we're getting up. That's why I'm up so early. So, uh, got the decoys and everything. Um, the deal with the turkey hunting down here is um, it has to be below the natural vegetation line, obviously, um, so you're not on uh, private property or shooting onto private property. So, heard some turkeys yesterday evening uh, before we left, so maybe we'll uh, start there, see if we can uh, catch those guys coming off roost and see if we can calm down the water. It's going to be hard to get them down onto the gravel bar where we need them to be uh so i don't know if it's gonna happen or not but uh it's worth a shot turkey season is just about over here in texas and um driving two hours to the lease or an hour to the ranch uh it's a lot right now just because the turkeys out there are not working first of all second of all they're all hinned up and don't want to respond to a call and they're all down on the river it's hard to get them to to work in on anything they want to stay on one side of the river and not come over and whatever so hopefully we have a big old catfish on the line and uh, who knows maybe we'll get a little turkey action too so see you guys when we get to the lake and uh, got about I don't know it's not a very long ride maybe five miles maybe a little longer um, to where we're going and then uh, the Sun will be coming up and we'll be hunting Looks like we got one, maybe. Yep. Nice little blue cat. Take that. First line of the day. Got a few more lines to check. Two for two. Wonder what it is. Another blue cat. Hope we catch a yellow today at some point. I just heard a turkey. Another nice little blue. Not 
Nothing. Was there anything? Doesn't look like we have one on either of them, but you never know. That one's not, no. Dang, nothing. All right, well, we had no luck with the turkeys. I just decided to combine these videos, so. We're gonna smoke catfish. Um, I got the uh, Camp Chef fired up. We're gonna use some Texana Brands Cajun Heat Infused Olive Oil. And uh, we're gonna marinate these guys for a little bit before uh, we throw them on the smoker. So put a little of that olive oil in there. Dust them off with some Critter Glitter Fish and Fowl. Go right into that oil. Just like that. Um, Riders having fun. Some more olive oil. And we're going to do some fresh rosemary on top. You can hear that camp chef getting after it out there. Just like that. I'm just going to roll these fillets. Let them soak in this olive oil. I'm just going to keep it at room temperature until the... Uh, Smoker until the smoker is up to heat, and then uh, we're gonna smoke these bad boys, see how they turn out. All right, okay, chef is hot. I'm gonna lay these fillets in there and let them soak. guys cook up and then uh, see how this turns out. The rain has started. We just put Ryder down for a nap so I'm not going to be super loud. But the smell coming off this fish is amazing. So let's do a little. We're about to uh, can some or make some pickled eggs. So if y'all want to see videos like that, let me know and uh, we can do it. But let's taste this catfish. Cajun, olive oil, crater glitter, and rosemary, I think. One out of ten. Ooh, that was hot. That Cajun olive oil, it has a kick. Pretty spicy, but that is surprisingly really good. That is amazing. Um, I'm gonna give that like a solid 8-1. It's not better than fried catfish, but it is better than a lot of catfish I've ever had. That is definitely edible. I think could have done a little slower and uh, lower smoke, but that right there is delicious. Mm. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, it's kind of two videos in one. I meant for it to be two videos, but uh, stuff always doesn't pan out. So it's pouring down right now. Now, so see you guys in the next video. New merch coming soon. This is one of them. Little sneak peek. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the thumbs up. And remember, eat good.